Hello everyone, today it's time for a new and pretty interesting video. So, um, recently for work I had a situation where uh, someone reported to the council that there were a lot of defect and um, strangely colored street lights. And when I uh, looked at the location I exactly knew what was going on. Since there's like a, a Dutch lantern, which was one of the earliest LED lanterns there existed, that now has a lot of problem with uh, defect LEDs and because some LEDs and specific colors are uh, fill earlier than others they start uh, burning weird colors and right here we have a very great example of why the uh, street lines are doing that so they kind of have similar LEDs to this one they have gr green ones, red ones, blue ones which together create uh, sort of a white color which these uh, street lights that we're talking about were actually meant to be like moonlight colored which is kind of a greenish white similar in the vein of like a burnt out murky vapor bulb but since they are quite old LED lanterns some of the LEDs uh, have burnt out and those were mainly the blue ones and the green ones but the red ones uh, mostly still work and what you basically got in that street is that a lot of red LEDs still work but the others kind of failed which basically created like a disco effect with uh, lanterns burning all kinds of different colors which I made a video about uh, I do have to give a bit of a disclaimer that like the road this street is on is very bad like it has like a, in the middle it looks like a sort of a lane of cobblestones that kind of separates one side of the road from the other but it's very narrow and I have to record and it's like a very bumpy road so the footage is not too great but still from that video you can, you can kind of get the ID And then you might wonder is there like a solution to this well no is the answer because these lanterns are from 2010 and uh, back in that time uh, the story went that like LED never really burns out or burns out after like 40 years which I mean turned out to be a complete lie but like it's the way that those uh, LEDs were produced like the uh, you can't really replace the driver nor the LEDs so basically the council is just stuck with all kinds of weird uh, colored lights and there were actually, uh, which if you paid attention to the video good enough, there were actually two low pressure sodium fixtures in between which were temporary ones. Because those were actually lenses that just barely had like one red LED working and the other didn't even work. So I have no clue what the council will do, they'll likely just replace uh, all of the street lights there. Or they'll keep it in place and it will be just a very fun <laughs> thing to look at. And in my opinion it still makes like the older LED uh, fixtures more fun than the newer ones. Because I mean they have obvious faults and it's quite funny that they start uh, creating like red light or weird greenish light. Or blue light out of nowhere which is kind of fun in my opinion. Makes it a bit less boring than it actually is. But please let me know what you think about the situation. Would you... Uh, keep the street like that or replace everything 
And thanks a lot for watching. Have a nice day and see you in the next video.